my glasses. Good morning, how are you? Okay. Good morning, how are you? Good, how are you? Good. What are you looking for? Woo! <laughs> I have, uh, I'll have things on the, on the porch eventually. Are you looking for clothing or anything? Sometimes, yeah. It just depends. Uh, geez, let me see. Uh, you don't need towels or sheets or... No. Blankets or anything like that. Okay, no. I'll bring that out. Pillowcases. Uh, no. Hats. Uh, okay. <laughs> Thank uh, you, though. Sure thing. <laughs> Hello and welcome to the haul portion of the video. I don't. I don't know what's going on with this. Um. So. Thank you for watching. If you're still watching, thank you also again. My name is Blanca, and this is Wise Thrift. Um, this is my YouTube channel where you come along with me to thrift stores, yard sales, estate sales, everything. Um, anything and everything. So, it's Labor Day weekend and I didn't find anything. I found one thing at that community yard sale. And I'll show you. It's a cool thing. It's an X-Wing fighter. Star Wars. Um, I believe this is the one you build. I have to look up more comps for it. I bought it for $4. Um, when I was there, I looked it up online quickly and it seems like they go for around 50. Um, so that will be on my Poshmark and my Mercari, um, closets. And then not much luck at the two community yard sales that I went to. But, I took two extra days vacation on, at my job, so I made it a super long weekend. And luckily, that paid off because I hit a few thrift stores and I found some stuff. So, let's see. Where should we start? So, my local thrift store, um, I found this jewelry stand. This will probably, no, most likely will give to my um, physical therapist. It's an anthropology. She has the bookcase. And when I saw this, I'm like, oh my God. This, I totally thought about her. Hi. Um, so then, what else did I find? That was it, as far as my local thrift store is concerned. Um, then I was driving to another thrift store. And um, on my way, I saw this random yard sale. And these... This group of people were having just like a yard sale. And this is this bobblehead Mickey. It is vintage. He had it in this Ziploc bag. Which goes to show you how well he took care of it. Um, I got this for $3. The comps vary between <laughs> 30 to $50. Um, so I'll probably get yeah, This will definitely be also on my Poshmark or Macari website or closets. Uh, then I hit my local Goodwill, and I found a few items. Um, this vintage Old Spice. I found two of them. 
in a bag, and I believe the pair were three dollars. And then, ooh, one second. I also found, yeah, <laughs> this Christmas sweater. I think it leaves new with tag. Yeah, new with tag. Look at that tag. It's amazing. At Goodwill, six ninety nine. So awesome. I also found these two men's Orvis long sleeve button up. They also look like they've never been washed. So I'm going to go with these are also new or very gently used. Um, as well as, oh, and I, I just realized I forgot two things from my local Goodwill. My, not my local Goodwill. My local thrift store. Um, they, they have a little handbag section. This is a Mikowski. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I always mess that name up. B. Mikowski. Leather bag. Tassels. So grunge. So like that Harley Davidson style. I love, I love, love it. it smells like leather. This is for me. I'm keeping this. If I decide to post it for sale, it'll be also on both websites, Poshmark and Mercari. And then this amazing Tory Birch. Hello. Hello, Tory. Tory Birch crossbody nylon in great condition. It's got this little spot right here, but I think I could take that with a little bit of water. Nice. Really nice. And then I don't know why I bought this, but I did. And <laughs> it's a wall hanging. A Buddha wall hanging. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's really big. Look at that. So, <laughs> I bought that. Why? I don't know. I love the colors. I love that boho look. I love, I love everything. I love industrial. I love the boho look. I love mid-century look. I even like, like, the classical antique look. Like, French. Oh, my God. You know, the whole thing. And then... <laughs> Also at my local thrift store. I'm sorry, I went completely out of order. Um, I got this beach wrap. I don't know why. Or, or was this Goodwill? No, I can't remember. I think it was Goodwill. And then back to Goodwill, I got this Ugg scarf. Where are you? It had Ugg. It was Ugg. It used to be Ugg. It's not Ugg anymore. <laughs> So, oh, there it is. There's the UGG tag. It looks like no one ever uses this either. I mean, there's no pilling. There's no, I mean, not that there would be pilling um, on a scarf, but yeah. So then um, I went to a few other thrift stores on that long week, on my self long weekend, or my self declared long weekend. And I found this adorable tea set. Dumbo Disney creamer and teapot and it's Disney China amazing adorable comps on those ran between like about $150 um, I paid 25 there you go and then also next to that was this set and I don't know if they match or not so this is a four-piece set, little cups. These are adorable. And this was $4. So all these pieces, $29. Not too bad. Um, I also picked up this video game, PlayStation Guitar Hero. I love Guitar Hero. World Tour. And then I get home, and I open it. And it also has, not only does it have, it, it doesn't have Guitar Hero. <laughs> world tour it has i should really check these it has guitar hero rock of 80s and it also has rock band for playstation 2 both discs they're okay i could quite clean that up a little bit you know what's funny is the receipts in there from whoever bought it before 
and let's see what else. Let's see. Yeah, see, they're not terribly bad, but they're playable. Um, what else I found at that thrift store? Oh, yeah. Um, brand new steak knives. And these were super interesting. The, they're vintage because I'm only judging it by the tag. Levi's ski caps or scullies, whatever. Got two of them. And then I got this beautiful cashmere beret. It's in the bag. It's from France. I'm assuming this is legit. I mean, why wouldn't it be? Uh, I also got from this thrift store. This amazing vintage blanket. It is Tid Strand. Here's the tag. Blanket is in great condition. Oh my God, yes. Wool, yes. Love it, love, love, love it. And I also got this vintage sweater. Pretty good condition. I don't see much pilling or anything. Look at that vintage tag. Look at that vintage tag. Ooh. I mean, come on. If anything survives this long, you know it's well made. Like, really, really well made. Um, I then ventured out. I think I saw a garage sale. She had a bunch of tapes. I picked up Lionel Richie on tape. I mean, who doesn't love Lionel Richie? And then I hit another Goodwill, and I grabbed this glass. This Mickey glass it has this inscription on the bottom and then a Shrek one also with the this one says McDonald's and this one says Disney okay so these are not the same but I thought they were um I think I grabbed a video game as well yeah I think yeah and a video game so that's about it it's a short video um I normally don't like taking the camera or my phone I like to film excuse me I normally do not like to film in thrift stores because it was a holiday weekend there was a lot of people running around and yeah I mean I'm not gonna film it oh <laughs> hello kitty she's huge like huge huge and she was only four dollars comps on her are like about 50 so I took like a Lysol wipe and just wiped her all down because I don't know, I, I'm just terrified of washing plush dolls. But, you know what? That's it. I don't have anything more to say or to show you. Oh, no, no, no. One more thing. And this is a, this is more a shout out to the SPCA of Malmouth uh, in New Jersey. Um, it's like the adoption center and it's also a thrift store. Um, they're like across from each other but in the, on the same property. And they had an amazing amount of um, pet stuff, animal stuff, like pets. So <laughs> I got my dog um, some plushes, you know, Christmas. <laughs> they were a dollar each. I mean, how cute. So my neighbors, um, my neighbors have dogs, so I'm going to give it to them. So yeah. Again, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe. Ah. Oh.